so I just really wanted to take the time out, uh, YouTube family, just to do a quick little video for you. Um, I was looking at because we had some issues with our AC in regards to it just not blowing through the um, through our vents. So the AC was coming on, but it was just getting frozen. Right, so I'm trying to figure out exactly, okay, well, what, what, what was the problem is? And you know, when it comes to AC uh, situation, you know, people want to charge an arm and a leg, you know what I mean? And for me, you know what I mean? I, for me, big family, I'm like, okay, well, cool. What's the best way I can be able to find out exactly how I can be able to do it? If it's a simple fix, then I can just go ahead and possibly do it myself. So that's what I do. Would I like to have done it that way? No, but you know what I mean? I took the time to be able to learn about it, explore it, see what it actually took. Uh, and then therefore figured out the information I needed to figure out <clears throat> Talked to some people that really understood what ACs are about gave me the information told me what I could use and what I can get and therefore now we to this point now I'm gonna show you the finished product really quickly real quick because this is what we just didn't have for a whole two weeks So <clears throat> This is our blower right right now you can hear it you can see it It's blowing out right now before the problem was is that this our motor was not blowing was not spinning in order for this to be able to work and blow out the air through the vents so therefore the ac in terms of the cool side of it and given the the coldness of it that was coming but our blower wasn't then sending it out into the house so therefore uh, we wasn't getting any um any air through the vents so now what i ended up uh doing so what ended up happening was I called the guy I wanted to talk to him because I really wanted to know what was going on. Um, so when I called the guy, he came on by, he looked at AC, he said, okay, well, cool. It's your blower, right? Automatically gave me that information, right? And, I, and, and, and in any case, right, I want to know because I don't want nobody to try to deceive me in regards to trying to tell me one thing and it's actually another thing. So I stood right here with him. I watched to see everything that he did so I could be able to validate that it got to make sense to me that this is the actual problem. So once I validated that problem that it actually was the problem, I, and, and in other words, once he left, you know what I'm saying, once he did what he did, I went right back in and I opened it back up and I pulled it out, checked it out myself, verified that based upon what I seen him doing because I'm a, you know what I mean, obviously I'm an electrician too. So boom, come to realize that it, it is actually the AC. So from there, I called around to a lot of people trying to figure out as like it was, trying to find a blower, trying to find a blower. Mine is one of the ECM uh, 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 blowers. So, you know, obviously, um it's a hundred it's a half horsepower uh 10 1050 rpms um four 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 amps uh variable speeds and uh it was another significant thing about it too as well uh oh yeah 208 to 230 vca of voltage right so that being that so i i looked i looked i looked i looked i looked for a one that would meet all those specifications again i didn't know anything I thought maybe I could just throw a blower in there, you know what I mean, and, and it would fix the problem. So I'm looking around for, obviously, a blower that would be not so expensive, right? Guy coming back, he next day he tell me that it's going to cost $700 to do it. All right, cool. I don't want to pay him seven hundred dollars You know what I'm saying? So I, I know I'm, I'm a little bit um, creative. I can go and look and find out exactly. If you're telling me that's what the blower cost, he told me the blower was like three-some. I was like, oh, and the label was going to be three-some. I was like, cool, well, let me see if I can find a blower cheaper. That's what I did. Called it around some places, talked to the people on the phone. Then they told me, we don't have the actual blower that goes to your, the original, but we do have a blower that meets your specification that got all the specs. So quite naturally, that told me that, okay, well, cool. If I can put a blower in here that meets the specs, then cool. That's what I do. I find a blower that got all my specs. I learned something that day, right? So they called one of my AC friends, and he then told me that, okay, well, cool. He say, well, what you can do is you could take it to this location to where they, all you gotta do is take the module off of the ECM blower and take it to them and they'll give you a new module. So I called them, they told me they didn't have it, told me what they did have and what they could, uh, the motor that I've had to buy the whole motor to replace. Cool, no problem. Now I got some more information. I just needed a module. So did my research, did my research, did my research. Show sure enough, finally came upon a module. This is the module. So it's very, very simple. Now, in the back of your blower, let me get back in here. In the back of your blower, this is how I fix it. I didn't even replace the entire blower, right? Which is this component. I just changed this module. It's two screws that from here and here. You take those two screws out, this whole entire thing comes off. Whole entire, the whole entire thing comes off. You take this off, boom. And that will then be inside this blower 
right? And you just snap that back on to here, the new one that's the one the one that's already in the blower. Because it's not the blower that's that's um that's destroyed. What I learned is that if you could spin your blower, then the motor is fine. It's the electrical part of it that's messed up. So this was the part of it that messed up. So all I had to do, take those two screws off, take this off, put the new one inside of, that was inside of that motor, take it on here, put it back in, put my two screws in, connect my wires here and here into my blower. And now my blower is working. We got AC coming through our vent. So let me just take you into the house. Now, here through my vent, I can feel air coming out. Here through my vent here, I can feel the air coming out. Even and in the vent here, all the air is now coming out. So, with that being the case, this one little part, and I will recommend because I took a chance, I'm not telling everybody to do the same thing, I took a chance with somebody on Facebook. I searched, I searched, I searched, I believe, I knew that I would find me one that was for a good price. I actually found this for 70 bucks. Other people were trying to charge $300, but this guy, he's on Facebook. His name is Jeff Russell, AC guy, right from Port Charlotte. This guy actually sent me over. I paid him. I was leery. It was only 70 bucks. So I said, okay, cool. I'll take a chance with 70 bucks to find out if this is really real. <clears throat> Outstanding guy. Was very communicative. Um, had no problem with, with being able to let me know exactly uh, 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 with being clear about everything, paid him 70 bucks, sent me the tracking number, sent me the box with my name on it, with my address on it, with all the information on it, sent it over to me, uh, and then it arrived to me the very next day, right? First, when he sent me the tracking number, obviously I went and I, I went to do my homework to see if the tracking number was fine. It was fine. Right. Because I trusted him because I just I just knew I can tell that he was an outstanding guy. But I wanted to see exactly how long it would take to come. And it wasn't showing up. So I'm only saying that to say this. Don't get leery if your tracking number that the person give you or that Jeff gives you is not coming up. It takes time to go into the US UPS system to be able for your tracking number to start showing actual movement. They got to scan it, so on and so forth. So don't worry about that. But I do recommend that you do use Jeff, man. I just I told him that I would give him a review as well, too. As long as everything worked fine, so enough. As you see, my AC is working fine. We've been in the heat for two weeks and no longer are we in the heat anymore. My kids are happy. My lady is happy. I am ecstatic because as a man, I took care of business that needed to be taken care of. So at this point, I'm very, very satisfied with every part of this. Thank you for everybody who helped me through the process, through the information that they gave me to help me to understand how AC is working, how blows work. Thank you, Leon, my man uh, up in Texas. Great AC guy. So if you're in the Texas area, man, y'all hit up Leon, man. Uh, and, and, I mean, outstanding guy. He told me exactly what I needed to do. It was only because of him that I learned that I only needed a module. And so from that point, I found it. And now we got cool out blowing. So I just wanted to take the time out to give you guys this really quickly, just to be able to let you guys know exactly how it's done, what you can do, and to be able to get your AC blowing by yourself so you don't have to spend $70. I saved, I saved $637 by finding this part, two screws, and putting it in myself, put my blow back in, and I'm working. And literally, literally, it took me about 10 minutes. Not even, not to put the blow on, 10 minutes including sliding my whole component, this whole thing, back inside of here. One, two, one, two, three screws. Take that out. This slides all the way out. Take these off. One, two. This comes out. Didn't even have to take my motor out. All I did was took off my one screw and my two screw over there. Took that off. Clamped the one that's inside of the motor onto here. 
put it back on, one screw, two screw, slide is right back in, zoop, zoop, zoop. 10 minutes all together. That's all it took me to do the whole thing. And now I'm back fresh and blow. All right? So, so I just wanted to do that for you guys, man, because I don't want nobody to have to go through the same issue that I went through in regards to trying to be able to figure out how to what they do to AC, paying some people some ridiculous amount of money. And and, 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 and salute to them because they got to do their job. So I, I, I definitely don't want to, you know, poop on any person that is in the service industry doing ac i'm just trying to help our, us homeowners to be able to know exactly some of these things we could do ourselves man kind of save us our money you know take your trip now man with the 630 dollars that you say i just you know what i'm saying go buy your dirt bike man i bought my boy two dirt bikes let's go let's go have some fun you know what i'm saying do something else with your money man you know what i'm saying it takes 10 minutes to get this done man go do it have a good time get your ac back man don't be sitting in the hot don't let your wife be burning up in there, man. You can't sleep. Can't even do your thing like you want to because it's so goddamn hot. You know what I'm saying? And, man, get your kids back to where they can be able to be comfortable and happy and sleeping real good up under their covers, cozy like they're supposed to so they can wake up the next morning and be able to go have an uh, efficient day at school. So I thank you guys for watching, man. Like, subscribe. I'll be doing more videos like this. Anytime I could be able to find a way, man, to help my people out and help y'all to be able to be able to save you a couple dollars, man, to do something on your own and give you the information that I couldn't find myself when I was looking for somebody to be able to break this down and how these things actually work, then, man, I'm going to do that. You understand? So I appreciate you guys. Till the next time, man. Signing off. Kelvin, man. Get your AC fixed.